Hello and welcome back to another episode of Seiko Modder. Before we get started, make sure you give me that thumbs up to help with the YouTube algorithm. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on the bottom right hand corner. Helps me out a ton. And we'll get started here on this piece in just a moment. So what we have right here is going to be a highly modified Seiko Nautilus. You'll notice that it is black on black, so this is absolutely going to be one of my favorite models right here. One of my favorite builds, I should say, rather. Um, texture dial, of course. Uh, case diameter on this is going to be right at 43.9 millimeters thick. Case thickness is 12 millimeters, so it's actually pretty thin. Lugs are 20 millimeters, so you can actually use it on this rubber strap if you like. There's plenty of strap real estate here. My wrist is 18.4 inches, uh, excuse me, millimeters, so that's centimeters, oh my gosh. So that's right at uh, 7.25 inches, and I'll show, you, show it to you on my wrist here in just a moment. So taking it through its paces right here, so first position, I already pulled it out. Just going to adjust the date wheel, pulling it all the way out, so you can adjust the actual time. When you're done, make sure you just push it all the way back in. Give you a sneak peek under the hood. There you go. Don't mind that red line, that's just a piece of plastic, you can take that off. Going out. So putting it on my wrist again, I am seven and a quarter inches. It does, it, this actually wears smaller than what the case size would suggest. Not even suggest, but what the case size is. It definitely wears smaller. To me it wears like maybe, about a 41 millimeter, so it doesn't feel too big to me. Let me know what you think. If you're interested, make sure you send me an email. It's going to be in the description below. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. 